When we think about looking and feeling great, you might think that the most important thing is sunscreen, not smoking, maybe skincare, or God forbid, plastic surgery. But what would you think if I told you that the real secret to looking and feeling your best lies in the health of your gut? Doctors and scientists are learning that the health of our gut is one of the most important things when you look at the health of your overall body and even your appearance. And it's the microbiome, those trillions of bacteria that colonize the inside of our gut that truly holds the key. The health of our gut microbiome can exert major effects on so many parts of our body. Things like our weight. There was actually a very interesting study in rats where they took a skinny rat, they transplanted stool or fecal material from the skinny rat to a rat that was overweight, and believe it or not, the overweight rat lost a lot of weight from it. It can also exert major effects on our digestion. So many people who have bloating issues can actually have those issues improved by improving the health of their gut and by changing what they eat. Our energy levels are also majorly impacted by the health of our gut and our gut microbiome. There are actually several studies that show that the quality and the health of your microbiome can exert a major impact on how your body extracts energy from the food that it eats. And one of the things that you've heard about on my videos before is the connection between our gut and our skin. And there are studies that do connect certain inflammatory skin disorders, like eczema, like rosacea, and like even acne on the health of our gut microbiome. So in this video, I'm gonna cover my five top secrets to improving the health of your gut and your gut microbiome. If you do these five things, not only are you gonna feel better on the inside, but you're gonna look better on the outside as well. Fermented foods are filled with beneficial bacteria for your gut. And these foods include foods like miso, sauerkraut, kimchi, kombucha, and kefir. Now the standard American diet is pretty much devoid of any fermented foods. So by adding these foods to your diet, you can definitely help improve the health of your gut microbiome. Plus, they are quite tasty. Probiotics are easy ways to get billions of beneficial bacteria into your gut. If you're taking a daily probiotic, like I do, then I recommend that you take one with at least three billion colony-forming units. In addition, a variety of different bacteria is better than just one type. Now before I get to my top three gut health secrets, check out this fascinating product that can improve not only your probiotics and making sure that they work the best for you, but also your diet. Thank you to Thrive for sponsoring this video. Are you struggling with a health issue and just can't figure out the cause? Well, the health of your gut may be to blame. When you don't have enough good bacteria, bad bacteria can flourish in your gut. The following may be signs of a bad bacteria gut imbalance. You may have trouble focusing or maintaining a positive mood or having a low energy. You may find that you are bloating and you've got constipation or even abdominal pain. Gut bacteria imbalance can also give you a hard time maintaining a healthy weight. Some people with a gut bacteria imbalance can even develop skin blemishes like acne and eczema. One in five Americans are struggling with gut health issues because of their diet. Too many refined sugars, artificial colorings, and hormone-filled fried foods are causing our guts to deteriorate. Thankfully, we can fix a lot of these issues with the right diet and the right probiotics. Thrive makes this process really simple by offering an at-home gut health test so you can know the status of your gut health and what problems that it might be causing. Thrive will analyze your results and give you recommendations about what foods you should be consuming more and what foods you should be consuming less. Thrive will also use these results to develop custom probiotics for you to help treat these problems. Now these aren't the one-size-fits-all probiotics that you'll find at your local grocery store. These are customized to you and your microbiome. The test will ship straight to your door with specific collection instructions. You activate your kit, complete the test, and return it. Upon receiving results, you will get a personalized food plan to help heal your gut and your microbiome, as well as personalized probiotics to maximize this as well. So I've been doing the Thrive Gut Health Plan, and I'm already seeing changes and feeling changes in my body and in my health. So if you're struggling with any of the health issues that I've mentioned, and you wanna see whether your gut health may be the cause, Check out trythrive.com forward slash Dr. Yoon. That's trythrive.com forward slash D-R-Y-O-U-N. And here's a special offer just for my viewers. 
click the link in the caption below to get 50% off your test. Well, now you know what probiotics are and you know how to maximize the probiotics for your gut health. But what about prebiotics? Well, prebiotics basically are undigested carbohydrates that act as food for your probiotics, those beneficial bacteria in your gut. And it's so important to get sufficient prebiotics in your diet. Now, there are certain foods that are great prebiotic sources, foods like apples, berries, and green vegetables. But a very simple tip to improve the prebiotics that you eat is to eat the rainbow. Prebiotics provide fiber for these beneficial bacteria. And by eating the rainbow of fruits and vegetables, not only are you gonna get enough fiber for that bacteria, but you're also gonna flood your body with antioxidants, which are great for your health and great for your skin. I am not a fan in general of dairy and gluten. And although most people can tolerate both to an extent, the less of these that you eat, in general, the better for your gut health and for your overall health. 68% of the world's population is lactose intolerant. And this includes 95% of Asian Americans, like me, and anywhere from 50 to 80% of African Americans and Latinos. In addition, dairy contains proteins that can be inflammatory, proteins like whey and casein. Now, although only 1% of the population has celiac disease and can just not tolerate gluten, I do believe there's a much higher percentage of the population that just doesn't do well with gluten, even though they're not celiac. Gluten is known to increase intestinal permeability, and this can lead to leaky gut. Now this condition, leaky gut, has been associated with an increase in inflammation of the body, and this can lead to inflammatory skin conditions like acne and eczema. So I've given you my top four tips to improve the health of your gut. Well, what is my number one? Did you know that actually reducing stress can improve your gut and even your gut microbiome? Well, we know that stress is a huge ager of our bodies and it can cause us to have multiple health issues. You only need to look at the US presidents and how much they age over four years of being in office and being under extreme stress. So if stress is so bad for our body chronically, then what can we do about it that is easy? Well, one simple tip is to meditate. Now, when you think about meditation, you may think, oh geez, I don't wanna take classes and, and be sitting uh, down for a half hour falling asleep. Well, very simple and easy meditation that really anybody can do is to set the timer on your phone for 10 minutes. Sit in a quiet room and just pay attention to your breathing for 10 minutes. Try to kind of get everything else out. Try to tune the rest of the world out. Don't think about your problems just for 10 minutes. All you need to pay attention to is your breathing. If you do that for a few days, you're gonna reduce your stress level and you may be amazed at just how great you feel by taking 10 minutes a day to do this. So this is my invitation for you to take the next level to gut health. You're gonna look and feel better just taking that time to do that. And check out trythrive.com forward slash Dr. Yoon. Trythrive.com forward slash Dr. Yoon to take that next step to use Thrive as a way to get there. There's a link on the caption below. And if you've been enjoying my videos, please subscribe to my channel. And always remember, eat real food, use clean skincare, and only consider actual plastic surgery as a last resort.